The following video might not be suitable for everyone. Viewer's discretion is advised. Hey, my you, you know where I watch. All right, viewers and subscribers, my name is Dan Saskila. Yes, I'm here again. Big up and respect to each and everyone. Now, viewers and subscribers, some of the times I get some information about some things that happened to persons out there in the world, it makes me wonder what's going on within the world. Why so many bad things happen within the world? Now, I have a video I'm going to present to you, and this video has been brought to my attention by someone. This video shows a man who said that he had been shot 33 times. The man had been hospitalized and both of his legs had been amputated. One of the man's hands had been damaged and he's asking people on social media for help to pay his bills and other things as well. Now, when I did this video, I did not get any confirmed information as to how to contact this person. But if any of you, my viewers and subscribers, want to contact this person or to help this person, I'm going to ask you to check the comment section of this video as I will leave a comment our comments in the comment section of this video letting you know how to contact this person if I get any information as to how to contact this person see it breaks my heart to hear the things that this person said viewers and subscribers and you can also let me know what to think about the things that this person said in this video that I'm about to present to you now some of the scenes in this video might not be suitable for everyone viewer discretion is advised here's the video take a look listen and observe the University from October 13. I lose both legs. One of my arms injured. I used to raise animals, pigs, goats. I also teach martial arts and do construction works but now I cannot do none of those things I have been shot 33 times it is God who saved my life and in God's will I would like to have two prosthetic legs where I can be able to move on again to help my family. It is so devastating to what happened to me. There is one of my legs right there that's one of my legs I cut off there's the other one right there that one cut off below the knee and I'm here struggling it is rough for me right now Take care of my three daughters. Their mother not working. I, I am the breadwinner. Plus, I have my mother and father. My father is blind. My mother cannot walk. And I, I normally take care of them. So, I'm asking you, all you people. Please, you can share my message, you can assist, I know God will bless you in return. You can help me pay a hospital bill because doing so many surgery and still have surgery leave, my hospital bill gone over four million already and I want to can move around where I can work to try 
to pay back some of this bill. But I need two prosthetic legs. It is not easy for me right now. It's not easy. I cannot move. I'm lying on my back one place. From 13 of October. I have been shot over my own things. Guys been teething my animal. I've been talking about it. They decide to kill me. They burned down my barber shop. They have done so many things to me. But it's the mercy of God. I did not die that day. I pray, ask God to save me on that day when they were shooting me. God did answer my aunt prayer. He saved me. But I lost my legs. One of my aunt badly wounded. Not functioning. And as I showed you before, here it is. As you can see, that part of the hand did come off in the wrist yes the part on the knock off but them so it turned back and I was hoping that if it can hold anything it will help me but right now it's one hand I have no legs three daughters to take care of mother and fathers just me and myself and my wife not working she have my daughter so right now it's only God know how to survive right now it's only God so please share these messages to all your friends and all of you know I am seeking help please please it's God will Thank you. Jano, my people, it's wicked enough. It's really, really wicked to know so that someone hurt you for something that you work for, you know. It's really wicked to know so that someone hurt you for your own things, you know. It's wicked, you know. Jano, no, Jano. Mm. I can only imagine the things this person is going through. You see what I mean? I, say? I can only imagine. I only hope so that him finds some way to overcome what he's going through. Because in my point of view, I don't think it is easy. In my point of view, I don't think it can be easy at all. You see the kind of world we live in, people? Hmm? You see the kind of world we live in? I'm only going by the things that he said, no viewers and subscribers. You see? The things he said really and truly touched me also. Break my heart. Can't easy. It's really rough. It's wicked. My people, I'm going to say this again. When I did this video, I did not get any confirmed information as to how to contact this person. But if any of you, my viewers and subscribers, want to contact this person or to help this person, I'm going to ask you to check the comment section of this video as I will leave a comment or comments in the comment section of this video letting you know how to contact this person if I get any information as to how to contact this person. 
viewers and subscribers let me know what you think about uh, this whole situation let me know what you think about the things that this person said here's where i'm going to leave it all right so until the next time my name is dancer skiller wanna big up on yourself you see it hey my you know where i watch